Hello everybody, in this video I want to talk about how to fix issues in your node module dependency. Uh, for example, I have this issue, image cannot show in iOS 14. And if we scroll down, we will see it's to, to fix it we, we need to apply changes inside react native libraries uh, files and to not lose it when we install our dependency we will use patch package but first of all let's uh, check the fix like right now uh, this bug you can see I, uh, it's uh, back button doesn't render but it should be there and let's apply the fix uh, we need to go to node modules then react native uh, libraries image and rct ui image view animated and display layer method we need to add else uh, sorry so this is the fix and let's try to restart our app We need to recompile it because uh, it's not JS code, it's native code, so should rebuild up from scratch. Now you see image appear, so bug is fixed. And let's save it, this fix. We will use patch package for this. To set up, we need to add post install in our package.json. Inside scripts. Uh, then we need to add dependency. I'm using yarn, so I need to add patch package and post install. Post install. Uh, I need. I, I will use it as dev dependency because uh, I don't need it in production. Okay, it says no patches found because after uh, yarn install and trying to uh, run patch. And as you can see, after we install some dependency, our fix disappeared. So let's edit again. and run our patch package to do it we need yarn patch package for yarn we, we need to use use yarn par, uh, option and name of our package it, it's react native for this case So now it's installing uh, version of our package React Native and it will compare it from repository and current version and save the div and then each time we will install dependency it 
it will apply the difference on top of the plain version of the library. Okay, it works. Let's see. Uh, and you see new directory React Native appear here. It's patch and it's exactly two lines we added in the div. Okay, that's it. Pretty useful case. It's happening a lot with React Native development. See you in the new videos.